this video, we'll be testing which mutant creature has the highest IQ. Hint, it's not me. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to my cow Bessie's top secret mob IQ testing laboratory. Our first mob that we'll be testing is the mutant zombie. There it is, guys. Check it out. It's loading in. Let's see what the first challenge is. It looks like they have to get past this wall. Okay, he's backing up. He's charging. Oh, Oh my gosh, he just busted through that wall like it was nothing. He passed. So anytime a mob passes the challenge, they get plus 10 IQ points. If you have an IQ over 12, leave a like on today's video with your eyebrow. Next up, muted skeleton. Oh, look at its ribs. That is disgusting. Let's see. Uh, did it just really walk away? That is a failure of a mutant creature. Next up, we have a mutant pig. Oh my gosh, it's a mutant spider pig. It is going directly over the wall. <laughs> that was probably the easiest for any of the mutant creatures. It passed that with flying colors. That is plus 10 IQ points for the pig. Comment down below which mutant creature you think will have the highest IQ by the end of today's video. Next up is the mutant enderman. It has horns on its head. And look at its limbs. Oh. It just teleported to the other side. Plus 10 IQ points. And uh, last but not least, we have the mutant creeper. I have a good feeling that it is going to explode this wall. <laughs> Dude, it had explosive farts and blew right through the wall. After round one, every mob but the mutant skeleton got plus 10 IQ points. All right, level two, shoot the targets. Let's see what Bessie set up for this one. The mutant zombie is going to go first. So there's three different targets that the mutant zombie has to hit. One on the left, one in the middle, one on the right. Let's see how quickly they're able to do it. It's it's standing there. It's what? What? <laughs> it smashed all three. It destroyed them all, but it did not understand that you have to shoot them. No IQ points for you, brethren. I have a really good feeling that the mutant skeleton is going to pass this one. Obviously, the mutant skeleton is one of the only creatures today that actually has a projectile. Okay, it's shooting. Uh, it, it just literally hit all three without even trying. That is going to be plus 10 IQ points, and that means the skeleton and the zombie are now tied. I'm really curious to see what the mutant spider pig is going to do. Okay, it did- what? Wait, it has projectiles? No, what? It just shot them all. Are you kidding me? It actually got it. The mutant spider pig, it takes the lead. How is the enderman going to be able to shoot them? It can teleport, but will it be able to destroy them all? Oh, wait, it stacked it. Okay, wait, that's actually kind of- oh, <laughs> even close. Sorry, pal. That was the dumbest thing I've seen today. All right, mutant creeper. Which mutant creature is going to be the smartest? Really? I couldn't have tried to like shoot out explosive farts? No IQ points for you. Turns out the skeleton and the pig are the smartest when it comes to archery. Level three, fight versus Steve. All right, guys, I'm changing my bet to my brother, the mutant zombie. I'm obviously half zombie, so I got to put my money on my family. Oh my gosh. Yo, he's exploding him! Dude, he just Hulk smashed Steve out of existence. That was insane. Plus 10 IQ points for you. All right, what will the mutant skeleton do? Oh my gosh, dude, he is lighting him up with rapid fire arrows. This is insane. Well, I don't even know where those arrows are coming from. This is actually kind of a, kind of a really, really awesome, sad battle for Steve because he did really good, but it was not good enough. The mutant skeleton gets plus 10 IQ points. Will the mutant spider pig be able to defeat Steve in battle? It kind of just stopped. Steve got on top of the mutant spider pig and started to ride it. Bessie, what kind of mutants did you make today? No IQ points for you, piggy. Mutant Enderman versus Steve. Oh, he just dropped an anvil on his head. What? He's teleporting and dropping anvils. This is unheard of. He's just taking the same anvil and picking it up and then putting it back down. What did we just witness? <laughs> that was crazy. And sometimes crazy means you get plus 10 IQ points. Last but certainly not least, we have the big, mean, green creeping machine versus Steve. I didn't even see Steve. Steve just exploded. Right now, everybody is actually tied with 20 IQ points. Level four is to avoid the turret. Well, there's the turret. There's the mutant zombie. So let's see if it's smart enough to try to avoid it. Oh, no! I didn't realize it was a one-hit KO! That is no IQ points for the mutant zombie. How about the mutant skeleton? I Actually, I'm kind of curious which mob is going to be able to pass this. Once again, the mutant creature gets exploded. Maybe the mutant spider pig will actually be able to pull something crazy off. What? Are you kidding me? It put up a spider pig wall. Huh? I did not see that coming, but you get plus 10 IQ points. Okay, the mutant enderman is going to teleport. I would put my entire life savings on it. I freaking knew it. Plus 10 IQ points. And last but not least, the mutant creeper. 
Oh my gosh, wait! It worked! It actually did an explosive fart and just teleported across the map. The mutant pig, the mutant enderman, and the mutant creeper take the lead. Level five is a fight versus five iron golems. The mutant zombie might not be the smartest, but he is the strongest. I'm gonna name him Jafano. Good luck, Jafano. You can do it, my guy. Explode them! Hulk smash them! Come on! Jafano has taken down two of them already. Jafano is hitting them like a horse. Oh, this is amazing. This is amazing. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. He's a beast! I don't know what that has to do with IQ points, but he gets plus 10. Next up, mutant skeleton versus five iron golems. What has happened? The mutant skeleton is like breaking its bones, literally in order to grab its bow and arrow. I don't know why, but this one's the funniest one yet. Wait. Wait. What? He actually did it! That was the smartest thing I've seen all day. Okay, well, if the mutant spider pig can do it, I guess the mutant enderman probably could too. What is happening right now? It's it's literally, it's it's cloning itself or it's teleporting so quickly, you can only see multiple at a time. That's how fast it's going right now. It just killed the iron golems in record time. That was pretty spicy, but what will the mutant creeper be able to do? Let's see what happens. Is that okay? All right. I was gonna say that doesn't really count because it exploded itself. So we have ourselves a tie. That means the mutant creeper gets plus five IQ points. The mutant spider pig and the mutant enderman are neck and neck. Level number six, avoid the acid pool. All right, Jafano, come on. Let's see what happens. Oh. What? He ran right into the pool of acid. I guess it's inside of this tube. No IQ points. Okay, mutant skeleton has to do something big here. What? I did not know it had this ability. It used its bones to make a staircase. That was kind of insane. Insane enough for plus 10 IQ points. All right, mutant spider pig, what you got up your sleeve? Okay. And <laughs> it just went right over. Plus 10 IQ points for the pig. Our next contestant is the mutant enderman. Plus 10 IQ points. And I'm really curious to see what happens with the mutant creeper. It was so fast that it actually got through. That means Jafano was the only mutant creature to not get 10 IQ points there. The mutant spider pig and the mutant enderman are still tied for first. Level seven is an actual acid pool. That does not look friendly. Oh, wait, are you just walking through? Wait a second, because the zombie is like pretty much dying, the acid doesn't do anything to it. Nice work, Jafano, plus 10 IQ points. Okay, let's test out the mutant skeleton and how it does. Oh no. <laughs> Will the mutant spider pig be able to survive the pool of acid? Oh, no way. Did it actually just make a bridge for itself? It did. That is crazy. How is the mutant spider pig so smart? The mutant enderman could take the lead or at least tie the lead. Let's see. Will the mutant creeper be able to continue to try to catch up? It did! Oh my gosh, it exploded its body over the acid pool. So somehow, every mutant creature but the skeleton was able to pass. Level 8 is called the rock. There's a mutant zombie on the left named Jafano, and there's a rock in the middle. What's gonna happen? Oh my gosh, wait, they have to push the rock to the edge, and then they can get to the finish line. Plus 10 IQ points. Okay, the mutant skeleton might struggle with this one. What? It has explosive arrows, but in order to complete the challenge, you have to move the rock. So the mutant skeleton fails another challenge. The mutant spider pig is going to need a miracle to stay in first place. It didn't even try to move it. What is the mutant enderman going to do against a giant rock? Wait, 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 wait. Is this legal? Wait, wait, wait. No, is this legal? It tried to, but it still did not move the rock. Will the creeper be able to move Dwayne the Rock Johnson? Let's find out. He's like, oh gosh. You can't explode it. So Jafano, the mutant zombie, was the only mob to pass. Level number nine, survive to the roller coaster. I have so much money on you. Please don't die. Oh, crud, dude. He didn't even stand a chance. The mutant skeleton has surprised me multiple times today. Let's see what it can do. No way. It just built a bone bridge. Will it be able to get through the cobwebs though? Oh, no, it got stuck. No IQ points for you. The mutant spider pig might actually be the first mutant creature to get past this. Let's see what it does. Wait. No, it didn't actually work. Let's go. The mutant Enderman would normally teleport through this, but it doesn't look like it can. It's, oh, wait, it can. That, okay, I lied. It can It can teleport with the minecart anywhere. So it can teleport over this. Yep, and it teleported directly to the end. Plus 10 IQ points. And last but not least, the Creeper. Okay, it's going up the roller coaster. It just it exploded the minecart. The Enderman takes the lead. The pig is only 10 IQ points behind. This is the final level, level 10, a fight versus a YouTuber. Hey, Bessie, you didn't tell me about this one. All right, let's see how the mutant zombie does against... Wait, that that's that's me. Bessie! Wait a second, no! Oh, 
I did it. I did it. I'm amazing. That means Jafano doesn't get any IQ points. Okay, will the mutant skeleton be able to beat Beck Pro Jack? Yes, get him. Yes. I think it's working. Oh my gosh. I'm actually kind of insane. If the mutant spider pig can beat me, it'll actually be able to tie for first. It said, OMG, you are so strong, I am scared. And then it died. No IQ points. The mutant enderman can take it home right here with a victory. Let's see what it does. Oh, it said, ah! And then it disappeared. I have a weird feeling that the mutant creeper is going to explode me. Oh, yeah, it's... Oh, I actually tied. The mutant enderman wins with the highest IQ.